So, thanks for doing this, guys. Woo, appreciate it. Hey, shaking hands right away. Fist pump, you know. Fist grab. Fist grab. I'm about to fist pump. I'm about to fist pump grab. So, why, why haven't you been on the mats lately? Matt was not talking about that. <laughs> 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 no, I'm it's work, man. You know, work. Gotta work. Gotta put it in the summer. I was there lots in the winter when you weren't there. You know, I didn't want to bring that up, but there's a lot of times you were missing when I was there. So, like when? Like what day specifically? Time right now. <laughs> what do you mean? Tell me right now. Do you keep a list? I keep list of everybody. Like, Glenn's not here every second Thursday. <laughs> Do I never see you in Nogi? Wednesday you're always like, yeah, I'll, uh, I'll be at Nogi, man. No. I'm not showing up to Nogi. Man, he's really scared. He's, he's scared, he's scared of a singlet. That's what he is. <laughs> <laughs> no reason. Good. No reason, man. I went to a couple Nogis. Just, uh, just it's like that. rocking the gi, man. Nice. I like rocking the gi. I'll come to the Do next like one. I'll come to the next one. You. Okay. Just for you. Oh, answer, put on speakerphone, dude. No <laughs> way. 100%. You Never. have to. Never. 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 What do you mean, no? no? You don't go live speakerphone with wife on record. Oh, it's a wife. <laughs> <laughs> That's, That's good. good. The true no. OG. Yeah. So, yo, so how long you been doing jujitsu for? Uh, about a year. About a year? About a year. Why'd yeah. you get into it? Um, Because my buddy Corey was doing it. You know Corey? Yeah, right. of course. Shout right. out. Corey, Troop MMA, you know, yeah, amongst other things, you know what I'm saying, <laughs> keep them low down, nice glasses, bro. He wears them better than you. He does, yeah, man. he does, eh? He's, yeah, he's got a narrow head. That was it, yeah. Fuck around with my narrow head. Yeah. Oh, can I say yeah. that? Oh, yeah, you can yeah, say what you, you want to swear, say, man. Can I say what you want to say, man? Come on, bro. Say what you want to say. I don't know if you can swear. Yeah, yeah you can swear. This isn't television. I'm a, I'm a, I'm a radio virgin. I'm a radio. <laughs> this isn't even the radio. It's the internet, bro. Drywall. Have you been punching holes? He's been Jake? drinking. He's been drinking. <laughs> so why'd you get into jujitsu? Hey, you've been doing it a long time, man. Long yeah. How long have you been doing? More longer. Uh, I've probably. I think I'm approaching seven years, maybe. Maybe seven. maybe in the seven oh, years now. Seven, seven years. Damn. <laughs> why'd you get into it? Uh, really? After after really college quick. and starting work, it just became a cycle of like you know, go to work, go home, drink a beer, go to bed, repeat, repeat. repeat. Yeah. And I uh, I worked on I worked and lived on the same street, Warren Street. Yeah. So, way back then there was uh, something called Team Shredder, and they had a big big letter billboard out front where you could post the letters yourself and change change the slogan and all that. Nice. So it said like uh, only BJJ Black Belt, Northern Ontario, Richard Nancrew. And then on the other side it said like uh, MMA, kickboxing, jiu-jitsu, wrestling, first week free. So Here this in. this this sign was on my walk home from work every day. Every day. So like I walked by it for like a week or two and I'm like, okay, fuck, I gotta do it. I gotta do this. Gotta give it a shot. I, I, nice. I think about it all like I walk to work, I look at it, I see it, I think about it. So yeah, I went in there. And I was kind of stupid or naive when I went in because uh, they had like they had each introductory class. They had wrestling, they had kickboxing, they had jujitsu, and then they had MMA. And it said clearly on the schedule like MMA was intermediate. And I went in, I'm like, I want to do MMA. And like Monkey and like Professor Ganku, I kind of laughed. I'm like, all right. So they threw me in with I think Sean Mark and uh, oh, like, I think Jay Gauthier. Okay. And uh, yeah, they just beat the shit out of me you know, against the wall. We did some wall work that day, and I like I ran into the ran into the bathroom. I think I threw up three times to the point where like my teeth, my back teeth felt like chalk because the, my stomach oh. acid was just like eating up my teeth. What the fuck? But yeah, it was weird, man. Like I got beat up to the point where I was like, fuck that. Like I gotta go back and not get beat up so much. That left like a that feeling like fuck that, man. I can't, yeah. I can't just quit after that. So yeah, I've been going ever since. You have to quit so far. Seven years. Seven, seven years. years. The first day yeah. sucked though. Yeah, well, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. First day was bad. Yeah, first day was so yeah. bad. The first day, the only thing, because I learned in Ottawa, it was my first couple months, and the first day, first class, right, whatever, there was no, like, oh, like, and now they do it, right, where they're like, oh, you know, like, you can, uh, 
like you don't have to roll this class, right? Yeah. Right. Okay. Yeah. Like, no, they're not gonna throw you in the sharks. Yeah. But so that was not my first class stuff. there. And at the at this old gym, shout out to them. If um, in Ottawa. Yeah, in Ottawa. Was it like uh, no you know, can? No. 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 And a uh, sweet place to train too. I love them all. But what happened is, after like my first couple weeks, then they started implementing that. Like, okay, now you get to uh, like now you have to wait before you roll. Me, the only thing watch, I knew it, how was like. It. Closed guard and break. That yeah. was it. That's all I knew. It was like break the closed guard, right? So you put the two lapels together, go hand on the hip, whatever. You knee switch or pull back, stand up, and then you break the guard, right? Step one, get that group like lapels together, hand it. First guy I roll against, clap hands, bump fist. He takes his lapel, fucks you up, opens it. Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> hey, open. Fuck. My whole Fuck. hand's gone. Yeah. <laughs> You're like, no. Try to grab his, you grab his fucking chest, you're like, get God chest hair. damn it. And then he just <laughs> swings me <laughs> immediately. Yeah, he was like, fuck <laughs> this, man. And then just got like su- swept and then he just held him out and just worked shit on my arm. And I'm like, God. Yeah, you get owned for a while. Yeah. <laughs> Still get owned, yeah, man. Get, oh, yeah, for sure. Still get owned. Always, I just start to delay it. Old. Yeah, just delay. <laughs> just delay. <laughs> yeah. Sorry, it's like the last man. three minutes of Devin today. It's a great day. Only tap twice. Only tap yeah, 16 yeah, times that's today. Good. Yeah, it's a good day. It's that's a brutal. Like, that's how I was the yeah. last of it when I was right. I had like Brandon and Jean Marc and Curtis and everyone beat me up. Same thing. Everyone's journey's different. Yeah. You always have those guys you want to roll with, or those guys who push you to get better. Do you think like it's best though if you're a white belt starting out to roll with other white belts, or like roll higher and just keep rolling like higher and get the shit you try to delay it? Anyone and everyone. Anyone and everyone. Yeah. Just when you're a white just belt, roll. not time. Yeah, just it's roll. all about time. Try not to be too crazy and spazzy because that's where injuries happen. Right. When like, you get spazzy and make mistakes, right? But yeah, anyone and everyone just roll. Man. Even through blue belt, purple belt, like, just, it's all experience, it's all nap time. And the more people you roll with, like, the more uh, diversified your experience becomes. True. Right? And then when you, you always turn into the camera. Hmm? You always like, you just I just like to double check, like, where the framing does is trust stuff. You don't trust like her timing work. on it. You don't trust her work. She's yeah. watching. It's like her first time. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh. First is this her first time? This is producing. Yeah. <laughs> producing. My first time. They always say that on Q92. I'm like, oh, I'm going to start yelling at her. That's, that's from a movie, Chris Farley. Something. Yeah. yeah. It's like a whole ass movie. I can't remember what yeah, I love old ass called, movies. Farley like Black Sheep or something. <laughs> yeah. Or uh, Tommy Boy. Tommy Boy. He rips the, the, top. Rips yeah, what's, the what's door the off his name. He's still alive. He David Spade. Him. David Spade, yeah. yeah it's fucking yeah. hilarious. Remember they're at the gas station there and he backs up, rips the door yeah. off the What'd truck. you do? What'd you do? <laughs> 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 fucking, is it Black Sheep or Tommy Boy when he's running, home, Boy. running home from school? And, he, country. and they show him as a kid. He jumps through the bushes there. And then it shows him like 21 years old. He goes to jump through the bush and the neighbor put a fence on the other side. What? Oh, fuck <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Smokes the fence. Jokes. I love that. Girl. So, what would you do in your 15 minutes of fame? 15 minutes? If you have 15 minutes of fame, what would you do? Talk to Glenn 15 minutes. <laughs> you can do anything. This is, this is the 15 like, minutes right here, this man. Is 15 minutes. <laughs> I'm like, 15 minutes of real fame. Find a, find a cut. What are we famous for? 15 minutes? You got, you got something? You got nothing. What would you want to be known for? 15 Legacy. minutes. Like, be, when every, every time Legacy. someone sees you, they're like, they're like, yo, you did this shit. Because of you, yeah. this happened. <laughs> we went here because of what you oh, did shit. eight years ago. First Indian on the moon. Yeah. <laughs> 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 Taking it back, brother. Taking it back. <laughs> Taking it back. <laughs> I like it. I like it. I like it. I like it. That's a fair one. Yeah. Hundred yeah. percent. If you get like more, if you get more, more, if you get more production, we could probably make it happen. Yeah. I want to see a rain. Dance made it happen once. Love a rain dancing on the moon. <laughs> <Rain dance. laughs> Did you do any like tribal dancing? No. Did well, you? when I was like a little, oh. little kid, but nothing. Not really enough to like no, do it now. 
to do it now, like we cut to a video. Okay, yeah. <laughs> How many of those Heinemungers do you need to have in you to do a travel dance? It's nothing to do a travel dance. <laughs> Jeez, man. Well, these the cultures. Low price now at LCBO. <laughs> Brand beer that we yeah. won't name. Um, yeah. That turns bro. Amateurs. Gotta not let them know. Oh, you can show off the pit. You'll get just... shut down for that, yeah. eh? Yeah. Good. Probably just for saying. Smart arrow? Saying, yeah. Bro, Even you, man, whatever that is. What is that? It's twigs, bro. Oh, yeah. fancy coffee. I, I just want them to give 10% off on every drink I have on the show. Yeah. That'd be nice. I can get you guys drinks for me. Same price. You really want 10% off? 10%. That's yeah, all your. That's, that's, that's what. That's what they're gonna. That's what they're gonna give me. They're not. Yeah. Gonna, and I'm gonna be like, no, let's go. They got good juice. In there. Yeah, shout out but to Mill first, Street Brewery, in Toronto. <laughs> I'll I'll put you a beer on this table in every episode. This is, the last episode. <laughs> this is gonna get cats. <laughs> no one ever seen it. <laughs> you can't like, go no. on. They're like, <laughs> go to upload it. They're like, nah. Sorry, dude. Remember, Wayne, remember Wayne's World when Garth was like. Uh, when they did that with Garth, and he came in in like the Pepsi suit, he might be too young. I remember Wayne's World. You might. You remember Wayne's World? Is it the first or the second? I know when Wayne's yeah. World came out. Uh, what year did it come out? Like 93 or something. Yeah, I was born in 96, bro. Was it 96? No, I got like... Yeah, probably came I came out the same some, year you were born, man. I got some But anyway, Garth Christmas comes in, he's, he's, like, he's like in a Pepsi outfit, like a one piece, and then like... He's like, then he eats like, he's got like a pizza hot box. <laughs> <laughs> no joke, man. Like, just sell so I, like, I would never sell out. I hate people that sell out. Oh, I don't Remember know. that? That's not the Wayne's first Wayne's World, though, is it? Is yeah, it I think it's the first one. Is it? Oh, maybe the second one. I don't know. I it's gotta refresh so. my memory on that stuff, man. I need like a whole library of 80s comedy movies. Yeah. And like a year of nothing to do. And no one it's called Netflix, bro. <laughs> this is not just Netflix. Uh, Netflix fails me, man. I mean, what is that? Nah, they just put junk on Yeah, there's so much junk on there, man. Like, would, so much shit is missing. That I rated YouTube for a premium account. I've been using that more. Really? I just watched something on PS4. How man. good is Cobra Kai? I watched Cobra Kai, it all yeah. Um, you know what pissed me off? I was sitting there, I'm like, alright, I'm gonna have some beers tonight. I'm like, watch some TV with my dogs. So I grabbed some uh, Coors Banquets. And then I'm watching the show, and the guy's like a, to- the guy's a total piss tank, and he's drinking Coors Banquets all the time and throwing them out. I'm like, well, this makes me feel great. Cheers in the TV. Yeah, he's like, yes. And then I'm like thinking, like, how many did he drink that episode, and how many did I drink watching that episode? Fuck it, don't, don't call uh, You can't count that, man. <laughs> it's a dangerous game. That yeah, was fun. Why? So, question for you both. So after 15 minutes of fame here. Yeah, he seemed to be like, yeah, he's, yeah. he's good. I'm just chill. No, I won't be an astronaut. You can't deal so, with that. Uh, I, I would own a golf course. You don't want to go for it. That's not 15 minutes of fame, though. Like, you'd be known for, like, yo, this guy had the greatest round of golf. I have to be known for something? Yeah. Oh, probably known for, like, the craziest off-road trucks you could ever see. I'd build them. Build you build them? Oh, Jesse. fucking right. Yeah. Jesse James style. Yeah, yes. Jesse James is, like, one of the yeah. heroes. Yeah. But, I like, Blake's, like, I don't know what enough to go by. You see that one when he was, like, on the ice road with a fucking motorcycle? Oh, it was, like, studded right out and shit? Guy's legit. And they, like, almost died. Everything, everything he does, I love. Him and some other guy. I love like, that shit. Go biking on the ice road. It's now he's, never like, been getting, done. Now he's getting older, so he's making, like, he's got a pure metal smithing shop, and he makes, like, all his own forge tools and everything, but he makes, like, firearms now. It just oh, yeah. the craftsmanship and what he does and what he can build Make with his good. hands just blows up. Push on it. You keep pulling. No, over. I'm not pulling you over. Holding her down. Jesus. Okay. So if that's He's what you'd drinking. want to be known for for fame, what would be the one car you'd want? If you, you could know, have I, any I'd car. I'd have to build a trophy truck and try to win like the Baja 500 or something. Okay. That'd be it. That's a good one. That's a good one. Nice, yeah, so it's, it's, you look straight across, you see the water fountain, you see now left of it, you got that bat, that hallway, yeah. Of, uh, yeah, down there. Sounds good. Cheers, bro. I want to be that tall. No, you don't. Oh, tall sucks. My back is crap. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> tall sucks, you know, airplanes suck, tall sucks. Uh, I was like, yo, what is he 
to it, yeah. I thought he was going to do the opposite. He's recycling. I thought he was the opposite. He's recycling. Yeah, that's true, man. That's true. So, man. <clears throat> We're still rolling? Yeah, tell me. <clears throat> yeah, man. We're going to stop for no reason. Like, this seat no more. No? I'm going to fuck that braid up. Fuck. Look at that. Look at that. Look at my seat. He could step over the table. That's better, man. Yeah. That's the people's seat. <laughs> What do you think is beer with them? Yeah. All right. I don't know. Did he? Beer cycle. No, I left it over there. <laughs> oh, oh but he took his old one. Yeah, he he's did. got more. Yeah, threw it out. He's got more. Fuck. All right. Fuck it, All man. right. So what's up? So I want you to tell me, since the name of the show yeah. is and for Glenn, will be no. Life After High School. Is that is that yes, the name yeah, of the show that's, now? That's, that's it's not just the Glenn on. Show. No. Right. It's there's two like Life, life After crazy, High School. Yeah. How old are you, bro? Twenty three. Just graduate one day. Well past life after high school, no? Dude, but it's like there's enough accumulated things I've done and like everyone I talk to has done more. Okay. Seems. So then I want to hear what you have to say about it. So, from one, when you graduated, All right. tell us. One, what, you're 28? Uh, 2006. You graduate? Oh, wow. Okay. Yeah. It's not that bad. It's not that old. I'm 32. I'm younger than Dev, I think. Think? I think. Yeah, Dev's pretty old, I think. So, 32's young, man. Shit, I'm <laughs> in my prime, bro. It's just starting to shine right now. <laughs> <laughs> it's true. What's so, your uh, day job? Day job? Yeah. An old servant, civil worker. Civil worker? You know, yeah. Just a, just a labor. <laughs> The man He's like, the, what the fuck are you man doing? Man with the shovel. Oh, that's gross. You have to edit that. You have to edit that. Blur that shit. Blur that shit. Just walk Blur around and step over. Trying to discover. Yeah, just step over that. Got your, got your cooler. Got the kit. Yeah, dude. So, yo, what did, tell us. What uh, What was your first year like after high school? First year? Fuck. Do you remember that far back? Oh, yeah, for sure. It was that long ago. Damn, memory ain't going yet. Damn, how the young is she? <laughs> like, you're what, 23, you said? Yeah. Damn, so, You're 23. So, so how old are you, bro? 30. 30? More than that, how old man. Are you? Yeah. I'm a baby. Shit. Shit, man. She's 14. Fuck off. You're not 14. <laughs> no, I'm university. <laughs> <laughs> I can do basic social math. Yeah. I know, I know how old you got. Unless she's like a genius. Yeah, she's yeah, you're a super genius. genius. Yeah, I am. Uh, no, I'm 21. That makes more sense. That's realistic. Yeah. So, what'd you get after? Yeah. Yeah, what'd nice. you go into? What was kind of the first I, just, year, like, I just went right to work, man. Straight up. I didn't want to go to college or nothing. I was done with that. That's what everyone should do. Right? Yeah, I just went right to work, man. Right to construction. Uh, it was alright. Making a lot of money quick. Living at home still. On the res. Just working on the res. And that's where I met Corey. In the res? Cause, yeah, because they came down there and did a big project on the reserve. You're doing like multi million dollar project. There's a bunch of us, like, like, like 20 guys from the reserve. Yeah. Got work and shit. And so, yeah, I started working there. And that's how I ended up coming up here. Because when job was done there, I just like, came up here, lived with Corey for a bit, for like two years. Mm -hmm. And then just kept working. Man. Nice. Yeah, just kept nice. at it. It's good money, you know, we're yeah. getting construction if you're not a dumbass. You know, they'll pay. <laughs> well, that's true. You're that's true. Stupid. There's guys who work construction for like 10 years, man, and they still get paid dog shit because they ain't worth shit. Because they just Because they're, yeah, like, well, you get paid for like your quality, right? right? Yeah, like if you're good and you know some shit, you can yeah. get paid more, you know, you can make a living out of it. Yeah. But if you're, you don't give a fuck. If you're just like, I just want to lay a couple bricks a day, yeah. fuck off. Yeah, like if you're happy with 15 bucks an hour, they're going to give you 15, 15 bucks an hour until the end of time, you know what I mean? Like they'll pay what you're worth. Yeah, yeah. well, you also got a password yeah. too, right? Right. I'm just going to give it away. That's right. So, you, why do you think you, because you say, like, everyone should go right in to work to working, right off the bat? Uh, I paid a lot of money in college and stuff to be a skilled tradesman. And, uh, it, I, I, like, I can't say it wasn't a, a good move. I just, I see a lot of people started like if you find a good company right they'll hire you as a laborer and you show them you like hey i want to yeah. be a carpenter or, hey i want to be a mechanic or hey i want to be like an hvac technician but you just start 
like at the bottom of the pool, like kind of like stocking parts on the shelves or whatever. If they'll pay for you to go to school, then that's that's the way to go. Might as well do that. And it's gonna save you, like now, especially because each year school gets more expensive. Every year it goes up, 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 up. It's crazy. Books go up, books go up. Four percent. Yeah, parking passes go up. Like every single, it's so expensive now. That, like if you don't have a, a strong financial backing from family or whatever, it's it's gonna make your life later very difficult. Like for me, I took out a lot of money from the banks to go to school because I didn't have money in the family, hmm. and I'm still paying for it yeah. to this day. And like I have a good job now, yeah. college is paying off, <clears throat> but uh, it took a long time to right. to get back to a level playing field, so yeah. to speak. So you feel like if you would have done that sooner, you know, if I had to just instead of take going to the bank and saying, "Hey, I need some money to go to school," yeah. I should have gone and just found the companies I wanted to work for and just tried to start as a laborer and ask them to pay for me. Nice, and then work your way up to the point where they're like, yo, if you yeah. go, you can. Because right. I see it happening now and I see these kids do this and they become wicked employees because they started from nothing Yeah. and they were given an opportunity. And they fucking said, yeah, let's go. Yeah, and it's great. Yeah. It's a wicked process. And I just wish when I was 19, I knew that mm-hmm. that was a possibility. Right. I was more rushed into it. It was like out of high school. It's like, dude, what are you going to do? What are you going to do? And I was right. like, oh, and you, you yeah, have no yeah, choice yeah, no but idea. to yeah. pick something. It's yeah. like, oh, they're going into the sure, workforce. Yeah. It's like, yeah. The well, guide, gonna the be, guide, no. their guidance counselor that I'm in high school, yeah. she's like, well, what are you good at? I'm like, well, I've always driven piece of shit cars, so I've always had to fix them. She's like, you'd be a good mechanic. Yeah. I'm like, oh, fuck, I guess. Here yeah. we go. Oh, yeah. And that sure. was kind of how it started. Right? Yeah. So, like, looking nice. back, Definitely would have done that. Definitely would have done that. Probably still would have ended up where I am, but I probably mm-hmm. could have saved a lot of money doing it some right. way. It depends, too, right? Like, some people know what the fuck they want to do, right? Right, right. Some yeah. things you have to go to school to do. Like, you ain't going to work yeah. your way up to become a doctor, you know? Like, <laughs> yeah, you know, start yeah, like, that's true, yeah, yeah, that's true. Yeah. Like, I, didn't, I didn't know what I wanted to do, but I knew I could at least enjoy the trip for, like, wrenching out shit. Yeah. And that's fair. <laughs> but I couldn't sit in a school for like six, eight years or whatever. Because yeah, that's what kind of like deterred, yeah, that's that's what deterred me, man. That's so so much I hated much class. That's a level like, of like, devotion. That shit yeah. was brutal, man. So much school for nothing oh, sometimes. Yeah. And then it's like people like uh, one of my buddies who uh, used to like host the, like my last podcast with him was, uh, yeah. he wanted to go and like he was in mechanical engineering. I think it was mechanical engineering. That's awesome. Yeah, yeah and he was like, cool, but then like, nah, not really, don't know. Now you can change so your mind. spend money yeah. on that program. Time, like, what's bro. a university and program worth nowadays? Like, how much does that cost? Uh, mechanical engineering is, uh, I think, 20, around like 10500 something per year? semester. Like per semester? No, sorry, per year. Per year? Okay, per year. For sense. like the still... fall, winter semester. So you brought like 50 grand by the time you're done your whole Yeah, like, Jeez. I think like between like everything I've spent and everything my parents spent, like I'm almost around the 40k mark. Wow. That's like, mechanical engineering is my goal now. Right. But I would love if I could get my job to pay for it. Yeah. That's, that's the kind of like... That's, hey, that's uh, the tricky part. When you guys need someone to do this... That's like the nice yeah. thing about the trades though. Like yeah. The trades, they'll always pay for your education, it seems. Yeah. If they see value in, value in yeah. you. Yeah, because yeah. then they consider an investment. Like, you're good enough that you provide yes. us with profit, so we're going to invest in you. Yeah, it's that whole, like, I find with university programs where you're going for a designation, there's no bypassing it. It's not like, oh, I want to be a physiotherapist and someone's going to pay for me to do my kinesiology degree. Right. It's not happening. Right. Because there's no starting at the bottom in like careers like that, right? That's like yeah. me wanting to like be an accountant. Like, I can't start as an employee and then just get yeah, paid for my yeah. There's some things you need that like receptionist. Degree for. Yeah. Make my way up from reception. So apparently, <laughs> yeah. 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 you'd be the best receptionist I've ever met, though. That'd be pretty funny, yeah. You'd just be yeah. like, "Don't worry, boss, I covered that one." She, that was you didn't want to hear that. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus, man. 
Yo, where would you work if you could be a receptionist? Like, where do you think it'd be good at? Like, one of these weed stores. <laughs> like, where do you get that job? I see these guys. I don't think they pay dog shit though. Like, <laughs> like they get paid like worse than McDee's, you know? Like eight bucks. But yeah, exactly. But like, it'd be a wicked job, right? Like, they're just they're like legit drug dealers. Yeah. I was like, what's your job? I'm a drug dealer. Dude, dude I was going to like BMD's job apps. Oh, yeah. That high life one, and just every had a job application for. A greeter for a greeter, for yeah. Greeter. So, like, yeah. you walk in and buy like, weed, like, this is weed. welcome, yeah, welcome. <laughs> That's it, yeah. That's it. It's $16 yeah. a day. We're gonna be a well, let's start here. <laughs> Hi, uh, <laughs> what do you need? What do you need? What do you need? Weed, good, yeah, weed. Yeah. you found it. <laughs> Which one? <laughs> <laughs> It's still it was an up. actual job though on Indeed. It's a You're greeter kidding. for High Life Cannabis Company. Jeez, in like Ontario? Yeah, but this is it's a new subject. So like when you go in, there's a guy who greets you at the front. Like the Walmart. Sh- yeah. yeah. Like make sure that you're old You're not enough. gone, bro? You haven't checked no? it out? You haven't just been curious? Like if it comes Leo, you want to see what the fuck's up? No, I, no, I think you're right. Just go check it out I think you're and right. see what's up. So we're going to cut right now yeah, to, a, uh, to a scene we just go. of that will be recorded later of us going into the <laughs> <one of> the <laughs> yeah. nope it's ready it's ready it's ready to go roll look once she uh she shows up yeah, once she rolls up, uh, she be, uh, she's got her fucking beige cruise. Beige cruise. Oh look, she's calling me. I can't make it, my boyfriend. Go for Glenn. Hey. What do you do? Like you, ha- you gotta stop leaving me without. Yo, you remember? Do you know how to get? You remember how to? Yeah, you're right in front of us, aren't you? Never mind. Oh uh, fuck. Um. Right in front of, uh, remember the way we went or we came from Laurentian? We passed it. Oh no. Uh, remember on the way to A and W, we passed it? Shoppers. Right across from Good Life. It's right across from Good Life. South End. Okay, what about it? It's right across from Good Life. Okay, I'm sorry. I just got yelled at by some guy who was oh. there. Oh really? Yeah, he like yelled at me. Why? Because like I was pulling out, there was like a little island behind me, and like he screamed at me because like I almost like hit it, and then like there was a bunch of like like the one car that was there from the other teenagers that where was there. Is she? Yeah. They were like just blocking it all. Where? Out. I'm like I had no fucking clue. Where's she now? Here, she. Where are you now? I am right by the the the, the mall. Oh, okay. I was like, yo, if you need us to go back there and handle things. No, be... <laughs> no, I'm it fine. says can of cabana at the sign out by the room. I don't think you guys see anyone up. Okay. Yeah, then, like, yeah, just by the Desjardins. Like... Okay. Yeah, we're like across the street from that, uh, from Good Life in the shoppers there. The shoppers, the shoppers Drug Mart. At the Shoppers Drug Mart. You can't get with us. Okay. See ya. Like what? Called Canna Cabana. Canna Cabana. What? Right yeah. That dirty Sudbury yeah, MMA like fucking sign. Oh, us. See ya. <laughs> yeah, well. Alright. Yo, Glenn, on our next episode, our we, next. we should fucking film us going to Sudbury MMA. And like pretend that we don't turn know my, jiu- Turn my, turn my phone <laughs> through your goddamn yeah, we'll Go there and try out some jiu-jitsu. Just turn <laughs> my phone. What, pretend we're all white belts? Like yeah, the, like, well, we are white it belts. It would only work for them. <laughs> <laughs> we are white belts. Yeah. <laughs> pretend. Like, I'm trying. I'm trying. It's not even on your phone yet. She's going to be here. She, so part like three or four or whatever, of uh, Glenn's radio show. <laughs> <laughs> Me and Bob's are gonna go into. Uh, I didn't pair up, bro. We turned it off. Cannabis. Can Cabana. 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 The laugh at the end. <laughs> she grabbing your camera? Yeah, she can grab it. All right. 
So you're, <coughs> Bob's, you're buying something. I got no money on me. I got no money. Glenn, you got any money? <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. We're buying <laughs> <laughs> Do it. Let's do this. Let's do this. No, piss sir, bro. Oh, he's gonna piss sir. He's totally gonna piss sir for you. Alright, let's go over here. <laughs> yeah, here we go. And if not, we'll just record around there. No, okay. okay, that's fair. I've been here so many times. Okay. Uh, Shit. Not right now. Shit, okay. Yo, the funniest thing happened, right? Because he's like, yo, that guy just, like, he knows. Like, oh, yeah, I've seen you here. I don't need to. I was like, like okay. What's he going to grab? His ID? No, I don't know. I don't know if I was going to grab you. I don't know. Oh, this is crazy. Thank you. Shit, that's so that's just fucking bullshit. Why is it bullshit? Because I can't see. I love that shit. She can't see that deer. That was literally today. <laughs> yeah. 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 Like jump in. What are these? Where is this one and six? You don't become addicted. You become addicted. You become addicted. Yeah. And that's, a, that's a government guy. Yeah. You gotta put exactly. that in every It's like the cigarette there. packs, right? Look, and everything? My, my yeah. problem with this is. Well, yeah. My problem with this is look how much plastic's being wasted. Why can't we put this in hemp paper bags? You have a good point. Yeah, that's a good point. This is a ton of fucking wasted resources. Wasted. No, it is. Because our background is on the street. Bad. You mm -hmm. got it in the paper bag or you just put it in your yeah. pocket. You could even reuse the bag sometimes. Whatever you had a glass jar, a fun, like a mason jar. Think about how many of these videotape this. But look though, but look though. I did. How many of those are going to end up in landfills? Every time. That's like that with everything though. Yeah. What do you got for it? So, my question. Yeah. Are you legalized for consultants? Not till October 17th. October 17th? Yeah, what, so October 2020? Uh, no, they're this year. This year? So October 17th is when legislation is here to change. Yeah. And then as soon as they take over, two months afterwards yeah. is when they start getting medical sales. Is it a guarantee? Yeah. Like so you get, all of our like, going to get like, waxes, shatters, rosins. So we don't know about waxes, but we know about rosin because it's heat press. We also know about uh, the shatters and the pens. We're getting those as well. Um, we don't know about. Uh, hash yet because we, we try to run it through a couple methods to it, like uh, uh, you guys can work with bubble hash, you guys can, yeah. So we're holding $200. Dang you. Which would you get if you came? If you had to pick out all of yeah. these these ones, sorry, we'll go with these oh, yeah. ones. It'd be a lot easier. Well, they're all the same, bro. Would you pick the bubonic chronic? Compared to like a moron. Make you chump shit. I'll go with the bomb. With the chronic. Yeah. You gotta go with the chronic. But which one's smaller, big? Yeah, you, you smaller. literally need like trimmer scissors. Yeah. 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 So, I don't even smoke bones really, bro. I'm a joint guy, man. These things fucking up. These will fuck you up. Guaranteed. We're gonna get some, I'm a team. We're gonna, we're gonna get some footage of the Glenn smoking joint later. No, you won't. Yeah, He's we never are. smoked we got weed. To. Now we've come so far down the rabbit hole, Glenn. He's never so, so far, far man. Why stop now? Even when I met him, he was like, I don't drink either. Like. Barely. But like, I do more now. Exactly. So if you start smoking a little bit of weed. In five years, you'll be cool. Yeah. I'm, I'm okay. Like, I'll be okay. You'll, you'll do enough. You'll be enough for me. So. All right. You'll do enough for me. Go. You get contact. You get high. Perfect. Dev's very against this place. Who's this guy? Yeah. Oh, yeah. He's just no questioning, buddy. He's got a lot of friends on the opposite side. So what's your, what's your average price for the last thing? Put it this way, if someone was just coming in to cut long, or something like that. Like, Dad doesn't like this place. Why not? Uh, He's arguing bombs. So if we get a price like 40 bucks, the price is like 10. And the bomb price for us is like 69 
That's your top of the market? Yeah, when you need it. That's a bullshit. So what's the nicest glass you got? Um, it's probably like that piece right there. So you're very confident. It's a percolated shoes with a fixed down stamp, 18 gauge. 200 bucks. 20 bucks. You're welcome. 200 bucks. Yeah, 200 bucks tax. Yeah. That's, that's yeah. sweet. That's awesome. Yeah. That's, that's a wicked ass ball. Right yeah, there. that ball's a little Triple too disc percolator, fixed down stand, 18 gauge. Uh, so if someone, was, if someone was coming in here, like just, a gun or a bong. Someone was coming in and wanted to buy their bong. Yeah. Someone was coming in and wanted to buy their bong from the front row, didn't want to get too fucked up. Yeah. Just someone wanted like, like uh, cost efficient. What would you sell? So I wouldn't sell them a percolated piece because that's more for like an advanced guy. Yeah, no, Somebody wants more percolation to it, right? A little more the, smoother of a hit. I probably sell them like a small vodka piece or even like a nine millimeter fan uh, neck. So they can get like that grasp of what an actual unit would be to the, to the size that it can reach up to. So like you can get like a larger unit and then you can throw some ice in there. So you get that smooth. That's still 100%. Oh, so you know, they, 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 they hit you pretty hard, right? So what did you bid? Oh, I didn't even see those. Uh, that's $59.99. Uh, six, so 60 bucks. Yeah, 60 bucks. And it comes with the the male piece, yeah. so you can remove the male piece and throw a uh, dab ring on top of that. Where it becomes legalized, so like October 17th. Dude, we, we all smoke, like, yeah. Everyone knows yeah. that's why we got conversion kits. Yeah, that's sweet though. 60 bucks, that's a nice little hot. Yeah, it's pretty good. Do oil conversions in it, awesome. That's cool. Yeah. Like nope. it. 40 bucks. Man. 40, 40 bucks. Set. Good to go. 40 bucks. We even got the discounted section at the end. Everything's 40 bucks. Bring me down. We got a presser in here. So these are all the discounted pieces. Um, we started off with the greens because we weren't really selling them very much. But all of them like percolated disc percolators, oh, splash guards. Yeah, it's a pre arm percolator. I keep a freaking yeah, closet like, in my purse. Percolated bases, so like. Dresser in there. Uh, what? Look, like, you want to see what a man carries on? Yeah, not, not That's a small it. Body. That's oh, fucking that's all, that's all a man needs right there. Look at this dresser. It's a fucking yeah, house right there. It's a house. 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 Are we down to this now? Yeah. We're going to buy some beef? Yo, that's yeah. sick. Yeah. How much does this on camera, bro? 800 bucks. Yeah. Dude, I, I like took it everywhere in Europe. Oh, okay. And it's still like last day, went through a vlog with it too. Like, it's best for vlogging, but it's also be like really good for podcasts, like beginning. Okay. So, I want to get to the point where like, I'm using a giant thousand dollar camera, no, but that's yes. what the sponsors are going to pay for. So, we'll see. I just got to grow, man. Just got to grow. I was telling Dad, man, we should do like a, like a fight companion style thing. Dude, we should. You know what I'm like the same thing. Get, get a couple yeah. more dudes in on that. Can I just yeah. watch a fight? We gotta do it like later on once the show is happening. It's gotta be somewhere with this. Yeah, yeah. 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 and drink and shit. Sure. And shit. Oh, I know. Yeah. That's the jits bot, you know? You start doing jits. Get this jits bot. <laughs> I'm not coming. Are we going to buy some of this wheat? What? <laughs> so you need the what is it? 420 wipes. So after smoking a blonde, you can fucking wipe your fingers. You don't smell that shit. <laughs> They don't work. There's nothing that can overpower <laughs> that don't. smell, bro. They Tell do me. Work. No, they don't. They do work. No. That is just smoking blunts. <coughs> One or the other. You guys want to take some close ups? Take them apart, get a feel for them, whatever you like. Let's see, let's see it up. Come on. <laughs> This is a 2015 model, XS5, got the extendable grip. <laughs> so oh, selling like a car, I have no idea what I'm doing right now. Oh, that's crazy, man. I mean, like why? Are, wow. bad, bad, bad. why? Why? You're good. They're bad. Why? Freaking grilling buddy for like a good like, 10 minutes. Yeah. Excited now. You can see it, but like, oh, okay. Yeah. I didn't uh, I think it's some weed. Yeah? Do it up. What are you going to get? I'm going to buy some weed. Alright, Bob, this is the strongest strain in the store. Uh, yeah, I mean, it's that fucking strain at 24%. <laughs> no. 24 is a broken one. 26 and pre rolls? No, because I thought of pre rolls would be goddamn dry. Yeah, we should get the pre rolls. The strongest strain is Seth Rogen. We're going to go to the parking lot with Black. 
All right, well, then, yeah, do a pre roll and we'll fucking light it as soon as we go outside. Glenn's a good boy. And I was starting. No, Glenn's smoking. What's up, the boss? Bubba, if you put me in a triangle. <laughs> we roll and you put me in a tri put me in a triangle. You put me in a triangle, I'll smoke it. <laughs> yeah, no, no. Are these all three joints? No. I won't do it if Dev does. Dev gets me like six triangles. Yeah, no. He does it with like six triangles a day. And everybody else would be individuals. Sometimes half gram, sometimes full gram. What's a good hybrid we got in a single free roll? Yeah. What's the highest? We got, I can't, no strong indicas because we're staying up. We're watching the fights today, right? So put a fucking. Yeah, we can't be. Wait, who's fighting? Oh, man. Uh, Francis, Things go right, maybe Francis me and this Gadu guy. And, uh, <laughs> Junior Dos Santos. Oh, really? Yeah. yeah. Uh, is that pay per view? No. Yosef no? Benavidez. Okay. Joe Jitsu okay. fights. Joseph Benavidez fights too in the co uh, main. Paul Craig, Paul Craig yeah. from Scotland's fight the fucking crazy new guy off the uh, Dana White Contender Series. There's, there's a couple of really good ones. So wait, it's, it's medium, it's medium or well done. Oh, no, no. Oh, 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 oh. The main event's heavyweight. Main event's heavyweight. The top I have for hybrid is very good. Yeah, yeah. Love it. Robert, you smoke this, Glenn? Oh my god. smoke this. This is Glenn's first time getting high. Woo! Go, Glenn! It's gonna make us crazy. Don't worry, Glenn, we'll get you right. He's like, don't get you cloud nine. Don't worry, we'll talk. We're gonna light it as soon as we can. Here we go. That's it. It's on him. Oh, yeah, man. Alright, team. He got it. Cheers, thank you. Cheers. Yeah, right. Come on, Glenn. Not a chance. Come on, man. Are you still in there? Yeah. See, all you gotta do is ask, brother. We got the footage. We got the footage. We got the dope. in there just like chatting it up with them. Oh, yeah, he could stay in there for days. My poor See how long they were talking about the bongs? Mm hmm. How's this bong? How's that, bro? I'd Good. say happy Canada's Day before I left, right? Oh, yeah. Canada's Day? Yeah. You mean Canada Day? What'd they give me? What'd they give you? Cannabis is our bread. <laughs> Mine too. Let's see what we got here. Look. Light it up. Box. There you go. There's disposals. It's like Dev was right. Yeah, that's Blue way there, too yeah. much. Way too much waste. You got lighters? And we got. And we got lighters from the truck. Look, more garbage. I don't think we can just smoke it here. Yes, we can. No, we not. No. City Vial of Boys. I'm telling you. <laughs> No, yeah, I have one on my. We're gonna smoke this tonight no, with Glenn. Right, no, no, we're gonna right. smoke it with Glenn later at the fight. No. <laughs> no. <laughs> Too much, man. It's it's so much crazy, crazy, man. Yeah. That's why we just bought this. Video video it's like a video it's 12 bucks for this joint. Okay, 12 bucks, 12 bucks for a joint. Yeah, bro, yeah. for this joint right here, man. Bro, we're not new to it. We're just got this. YouTube. We're just trying to get it. That's the first joint. I got one in my car. Alright. Fuck that. I just told them when we were in there I was going to light it when we left. Oh, so they probably called the cops already. Alright, yeah. Yeah, they might. Yeah, they might. Yeah, they might. Don't push him if he... He might crush me. Glenn, you have to drive. And he's never done it before, the little baby. Never have. He's a good That's boy. Is, man. That's cool though. I like it. You're a good boy. I like your style, man. Don't touch it. Oh. I'm not mad. I'll keep my weed, bro. I'll keep my weed. Your weed, bro. He's like, yeah, fuck this guy. I want it all.
Uh, bought this weed legally. From we a bought store. it legally. Or from right, a store. Right from from, from a store, store, bro. I could went and got milk. Just as easy. Milk. You know what I mean? Got a fucking milk? fancy milk. little holder for my milk. Like they got the box and shit. <laughs> Triple percolated milk. Two hundred. <laughs> Yo, were you grilling him, or you think you were just like you like you? You had all your answers, bro. No, I don't really. I, no. I don't work. He looks at me and goes, these are the, 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 the competition for Dennis, right? Yeah, it is. Like Corey. Well, no. Scratch it. Edit it. You know what I mean? That's like, that's like the one. You know, this is like the one. You see the guy? Yeah, go. No, I just see the last name. There's a thousand cars out there, bro. We're just gonna, he's gonna edit it out. Yeah, you yeah, won't even have to edit that. Well, you know what I mean? You're every day drunk dealer. W order came up to thirteen dollars. Yeah. What? When you guys read L C B O. You're getting beer, you're getting in dubs, man. I got the short end of the stick on that one. Legal cannabis. This is it. I'm, I don't remember that. I'm done. <laughs> the round in the end. <laughs> You're like, no. I get spent sometimes, bro. Yeah, dude. I'm like, but you go too right hard on rounds I feel, too. Yeah. So, yeah. the warm ups is hard. Woo! Get out of there. Yo, what's the button, dude? What's Who the button? Honks the horn. Oh, yeah? That's custom. Yeah. That's custom. That's custom. It is, yeah. So, is the button that pushes the start. Good ass dude, turn the key over. You said dead ass a lot. Yeah, I trained myself to say it because my old buddy Davin used to fucking. Your old buddy? Yeah, my old buddy Davin used to say it like. Old he buddy. Yeah. He's your old buddy now? It does. I've had so many times where I woke up and they sent me a message to me naked. I'm like, oh, oh God. Party naked problem? Pretty good at party and naked. See? Shit happens. Oh my god. Ta da! Ta da! <laughs> and um, seeing how it's gonna go. So, Alyssa, you're gonna follow us. This is like right now, we're making this up. You sit dead ass. You're gonna yeah. follow us dead and ass. see you us going. I know, yeah. Yeah. You probably can't film this either. Either. Record it. I mean, I love this idea. You you can't. Can't. We're yeah, going to do it. It's a thing. Right. You probably yeah. can't film this either. Uh, it's idea. totally legal. There's no reason why you can't. Record and we'll find out. Like, I'm gonna get carded, we'll but that's okay. Out. We'll find it. High life. You're old enough though. I know. The woman, there was a woman yeah, who right. was behind me when I went in. I got carded. The woman behind me was like, you're not going to card me? I'm like, oh, oh you look 40. Man. 40? <laughs> Damn. That's Did an insult. 39? Yeah. Jeez. Jeez. I used yeah. to be happy when people thought I was older. Me like, too. Yeah, yeah, like, you know what I'm Like, you, you were like, I love you it. look like you're like 25. You're like, yeah. You're like, yeah, I do. I was. Yeah, yeah. yeah. No, yeah. you're like, <laughs> I was recording something like a couple weeks ago, and I met and like I met this guy. I was like, he was like, how old? How old are you? And uh, he was like, I was like, what? Like 20? I was like, what are you 24? Because you always want to aim lower, right? Yeah. You know what he says? Aim He's lower. like, well, I'm like 25, 26, 27. Yeah. Which one is it? Which was that? You can't fuck? choose your age. Yeah, it's, <laughs> yeah. a, it's like, uh, uh, I uh, close my eyes. That number. No. <laughs> no. So, yeah, that's what's going to happen. Year where you born. Yeah. We're going to go. Get some weed? You're going to record, and whoever needs weed, going to go. And you're gonna, I want to experience some this. Weed? Oh, yeah. 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 Right. I guess we'll get some weed for Dev. I mean, if he needs it. Yeah, yeah. I think he should. 
Yeah. Okay. Is this sponsored by their engine or anything? Who's it gonna, should be. Who's gonna pay? It should be. Yeah, it should be. Get the SGA to sponsor it. Yeah. You want to? You want to? Uh, you can just go and get sponsors. Hamburg, hit up the uh, SGA, Alyssa, and uh, like, hey, uh, you guys have a, there's a podcast apparently on campus. They're recording in your space. You should uh, hook them up. Hit them up. Let them know. We'll put like some stickers and yeah. shit on the table. A couple of weeks. I'll have them pop up. All the wrench and merch. Yeah. I don't know if I'm <laughs> bomber jacket. Good. Good. <laughs> yeah. You'd be rocking out the wrench. You can just stand in the back with the jacket on, turn backwards, flexing it down. That'd be pretty sweet. You should. The wrench, should, man. Yeah. Sounds like you're building you some next. Yeah. Get some wrench down. Write that in your book. I'll write that shit in my book. Keychains. <laughs> <laughs> Keychains. It's like necklaces. Keychains. Like, Which uh, jujitsu like center do you guys go to? I don't think they want us to say after all uh, that. Uh, Didn't we already say yeah, it? Yeah, three times. Yeah, I already said it. Yeah, you already said it. It doesn't yeah. matter. No one wants to say it. It's like a secret club. Okay. No one, never mind. Never no one mind. talks about Fight Club. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no one talks about Fight Club. <laughs> oh, dude, just cut that out. Why would you ask that? that. Why would you ask that? It's not terrible. It's just a tough question. Oh my god. I just asked the So I started ballet in grade four. <laughs> and I hated it, but my mom made me continue. And then I met Baba. <laughs> In ballet. Yeah. Yeah. It's good yeah. for sports. Yeah. You should. This guy's toes are so fucking strong. They're so pointy, man. Like they're they're fit right in the shoe. <laughs> they were pointy. I said they were strong. Strong. But they're they're not shooting. pointy. <laughs> you seen those freaking ballet dancers' feet, dude? Wow, because when the show like, oh, yeah, they do. They're tough as shit. They're so no, it's the shoe, man. man. I'm, the shoe I'm is like supported yeah, like that. They're see, like not on their toes. These people oh, across the I think it's like the shoe, players. isn't it? I'm scared. Yeah, the shoe is made to support that. Because there's no way you can like bounce on your toe like that. You can snap yeah, you that like bitch. Yeah, you like curve in your toes. Right. And yeah. then you're more so like on the knuckle of your toe. Yeah. yeah. Like, you're so wearing those shoes right now. No, I'm not. These are hard. Yes, you are. Oh, he's got his own camera. Yeah, it's been live for a bit. That's so funny. Dumb, dumb. Yeah. She's like, yeah, I'm not, but, I'm, not but, like, I'm not, but like, look at him. <laughs> you know? Yeah. Jesus Christ. That's funny. Fellas, there's a segment mm-hmm. that I have created, okay? This and it's called, shows. oh yeah. So it's called, explain yourself. Explain yourself. So we'll, which one do you guys want to start first? Bubba does. Bubba does? All right. What? That's fair. Fuck no. So what I've done is I've went on each of your Instagram accounts, Uh-oh. found the photo, <laughs> and I'm nice. gonna. It's gonna be up. Yeah. Put it up, and I want you to explain yourself. Okay. Explain you what? Up. Explain this photo. So. I'm not Bubba, good. Yeah. This photo. You have like a pretty like easy Instagram. Like it's not. Yeah. I'm not, not a lot to it. So it goes like when stuff. you finish rolling. Yeah. With someone who forgets to trim their fingernails. Yeah, it's Bruce Lee, man. Yeah. Tell us what was your take on posting this? Like, who'd you roll with? What kind of happened? Like, what was about that? About? That's before I really knew anything about Instagram, man. So yeah. I was like posting a picture. Okay. So I didn't really know about memes and all that shit. And it just looked funny. And, you're funny. and I got scratched by somebody yeah. that night, I think. Do you trim your nails and stuff? Like, how I like do you bite my before? nails. Bite them off? Yeah. yeah, so I really don't have any nails. Okay. So. You yeah. so, who scratched Huh? Who scratched you? People scratch sometimes. You get yeah, scratched. Yeah, yeah. You get scratched, yeah, right? Yeah, sometimes. Yeah. You can't, even if you trim you your nails. Out, eh? Was it hmm? me? Was it me? Yeah. If it's one of us, I've you can say it's one of us. By both of you. <laughs> scratch numerous, you right now. But numerous. it happens. <laughs> you know? Numerous. It happens. You get scratched. Yeah, it does. Right? Yeah. Well, you don't get it in the eye. It's young, like right? when you're like, I was rolling with like uh, Alex like a while ago, and like my foot slipped when I went to like hip out. And like I caught his, I caught him in the mouth, like in the mouth. And I was like, oh no. But it's like, like I was rolling with you, and we were doing like uh, the three minute rounds, like three minutes, like one in, one out. Yeah. Right. And um, and like I think when you turned or something, like your forearm went, <laughs> and you knew it because you like you like apologize and you're like, man, I'm sorry for that. I was like, oh, yeah. I literally was like, oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah, yeah you get the I was like, I literally like closed my eyes. I was like, I'm just gonna fight it until yeah. the time goes. I can't. Man, I couldn't open my eyes. I was like, oh no. It happened yeah, it happens. Yeah, it happens. You hear that click, you're like, oh shit. All right. So I always get smashed <laughs> up by you. Both of you, you're real squirrely as fuck, and you're just lengthy. 
And we got fucking like arms and legs everywhere. Getting smacked and shit all the time. You could have just yeah. said I'm good at jujitsu. Eh? Well, you could have just said I'm good at saying. <laughs> Fuck, it's a little squirrely. bit early. It's Freak very lengthy. Alright, now that we're on this, uh, yeah. your little thing there. Yeah. Your little rant and rave. Yeah. Well, my Bruce Lee yeah. picture, which was sick. Oh, no. Maybe you should explain yourself. <laughs> Fuck right off. Fuck right off. Maybe we should explain ourselves, Glenn, because this is on yours. I think you're shaving. I don't know. Are you doing the full face on that? Yeah. Wow. So, yeah. We got two cameras going. Maybe. See that? Did you see this? Oh my god. 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 So, that was so long. Were you just learning to shave at that point or anything? Or? You look like Was that Neil. the first time? Uh, doing a great job, by the way. I usually don't play, but I like the towel formation, though. You gotta read the caption at least. It explains something. Oh my god, man. I'm just crying. I totally forgot. What the fuck? Big bang, boom. Bang, boom. Gotcha. boom. Uh, yeah, read the caption. Like, read the caption. No, I okay. want to hear it live. Okay. From you. Yeah, we need a we need a full yeah, we need long explanation. explanation. I want to know why is the towel oh, like spot. this? Okay. Okay. Oh, this is gonna go. Getting upset. You're scratching yourself a wedgie every time I try to relax. Oh shit. This okay. chair's not very forgiving. <laughs> It was, was right it was my first time. It was my first time. Oh my god. Whew. So, are these doors sealed? I hope so. And you should have like pushed me. Yeah, was... Come in, Gary. Good. Like it. Let's go. So, <laughs> Jesus Christ. Um. So, I was living in, like, that was my first year at the uh, village. Living on my own village. in Ottawa, not, in, <laughs> not just in res. But essentially, I was. Uh, I was scrolling through this bros being basic Instagram page. There's a friend of mine from the camp. Like she was, she was like, "Oh, he's checking it out. They're really funny." And it's like dudes doing like the most basic, like female stereotypical things that okay. they do, right? Yeah. Like drinking Starbucks with their pumpkin latte, whatever. Like, yeah, yeah, exactly. And yeah. so I was like, "Okay, cool." So one of their photos was similar to this. So it was like they're just like shaving it, and I was like, "Man, I gotta shave." So then, like when I was shaving my beard, because like this back of like the beard wouldn't come in as well, so it looked like blotchy right? and shit. Yeah. yeah, like but the, only the mustache would grow. Yeah, it wouldn't connect. It yeah. wouldn't connect Nothing the would beard. Con it yeah. never connects here. <laughs> that was years. Never connects here. Take here. Yeah, so I was like, you just got it. And then I was like, I was like, oh whatever, you know. And then so I'm like spraying shaving cream my face. I'm like, rough. I'm like, all right, I gotta shave this shit. And I was like, and I put it on my head. Like the part, because like my hair was pretty long at that point, so it was like come down my face. I don't want to have to just keep doing that stupid stuff, you know? It's like keep it short, right? Yeah. And so and I was like, whatever. And I'm like, yeah, this is fun. It's kind of, I was like, yeah, right, cool. I'm shaving away. I'm like, you know what? Let's like, I was like, yeah, this is, I was like, you know what? It'll be funny. Let's do this. <laughs> covered it up, started shaving, and was like, with like the worst, like an S3. <laughs> they yeah, took that photo the with. It's like six inch thick bone. Yeah. I was like, yeah, and then I just clicked and I was like about to get my grooming on, but first let me take a selfie, of course. About to get my grooming yeah. on. I was trying to get sponsored by Gillette at that point, and then I was like, that's so shaven. That's so shaven. Blades man. of glory. <laughs> nice blades of glory. Uh, Baltimore shavings. That's one for all you football fans. Uh, and then I had like some random person, Mad Frosty. Oh, I think it was my buddy Zach. Yeah. He was like, oh no. And then the girl I was doing at the time was like, this just made my day. They didn't like it. She didn't break Probably up. Probably should have liked it. Which that was funny. <laughs> did you like? Yeah, I didn't like it. Really? I don't know. And then my current girlfriend now was like, wow. And I was like, all right. Double tap that. And then someone's like, me too, Glennie. And I was like, what the fuck? <laughs> and then right after, I was like, why are you liking this? And I was like, then. And then she said, on her other account, the same, but I was like, this is why your beard's patchy. <laughs> I was like, well, <laughs> part of me wants to delete it, but there's like, you know what, I'm, I should. There's history like now. You took there's every history one of those now. comments right to your heart. There's history now. They all, yeah, like, at it. the time, there was emotion that there was emotion. through those <laughs> yeah. comments. I was like, ooh, yeah. okay. You can't read the comments. Cause, you know, cause one of my, my buddy's first comments. comment, dude, with his um, like, oh no, it's like my buddy Zach, and we, when we counseled together at summer camp like seven years ago, right? I like, I was like, I don't know, it was one of those days, man. I was, I was like 17, probably yeah. 18. <laughs> this was last week. 
Um, <laughs> I, I was just like shaving through myself. I was like, fuck, oh, whatever. And I was like, okay, I gotta do something. And this, I was like, yeah, I'm passionate. I was like, I don't want to hear your chest. I can just shut that all down. You know? That was it. So, that's kind of what happened. Now, we'll go to Devs. I got one for Dev. Yeah? Well, Explain well. this. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> Which one? <laughs> oh no! <laughs> you know that. Show me it. Show me it. Oh, my phone's fine. Oh, is that porn? Is that porn? Dude, dude, you're not supposed to be showing that. Yeah, we're in the university. You know how many people you get hit that? This is when we go yeah. to my I was trying to get Mitch yeah. that. Didn't I tag Mitch in that thing? I don't know. Yeah, yeah. he did. I tagged Mitch. I was trying to do this. Explain. He gets no, he's every time he's got one for you. Like. Yeah. But yeah. I think I'm at like He's a got problem. a better one, I bet. Right, so, because he's go. done I'll his leave, homework. I'll leave it on. For one of his homework. So, I'm curious the process behind it, because I know you like your dogs. Yeah, it's always this dog shit. Man. I gotta close this thing. Man. So what is this one? That? Yeah. It's been like, take me through the moments leading up to that. That's like me, that day. That's me yeah. trying to go to work. And he just... I'm like, get chill. the fuck out of bed, you lazy cunt. And he just farts. That's it. That was it? That's it. What does this fart sound like? Oh, I don't know. Oh, I say... You never owned a dog? It smells way worse than it sounds. Yeah, but I have to scream worst, at him. I have to run over and pound my fucking arms on the bed. And then he's like... And he looks at me and like... I'm like, no. Food, walk, I have to go to work to make money to pay for this house. And he is just like... Fart number two. <laughs> fart number two? Gives no, I'm not dogs don't give any that's, fuck about your schedule. Look at the picture. <laughs> Does it look like he wants to get up? No. Exactly. No, you're right. Not at all. He's not fucking moving. Not even in like a little bit. He's too. 90 pounds. Do you want to try to move him? Hey, dogs are nuts, man. <laughs> yeah, he's a big dog. His dogs are nuts, man. Yeah, like like, like, and then when I, I go to his place, he's like, come in. I'm like, hell no. <laughs> <laughs> I, 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 I'm entering this place until you come. Pick me up. You got to come to the door. Because I got both dogs right now. Because those dogs are going to like. He's like, fuck that. I'm a bird guy, man. They pimples. I'm a bird. They're destroyed. Yeah. I'm a bird dude, bro. I like birds. I own birds. It's yeah, they are. You yeah. old birds? No. But <laughs> I want to. That. I want to, though. First time you met my dog, he's like, fuck that. I'm a bird guy. <laughs> yeah, I'm a fucking bird <laughs> Some people like dogs. Some people <laughs> I like cats, you know? I like birds. Oh, God. Whew. Even those are scary as fuck, though. Birds? Cause, yeah, my buddy, his dad owned birds when they were, like, growing up on the res. And I'd go to his place. And all of a sudden, this fucking bird would just fucking come flying out of fucking nowhere. Land wherever. Land on his dad. Just chill there. His dad just purrs like a little fart on the shoulder. No, it never shit all like over. It, it didn't shit all over. It shit like in the cage. I don't know how the fuck you get a bird to do that. Yeah, <laughs> but like, it was like a free range bird, man. Just like flying around the house. Yeah, I think it was scary as fuck sometimes. Though. I don't think you needed like, to be as scared as you were of that bird. I feel like that bird. Man, was if something well came flying, if something <laughs> flying past your head. <laughs> In your zone, because I'm up there too. Almost hit a bird on the way here. Yeah? That was freaky. I was like, it's that bird's fucked. What the fuck? That was freaking me out. Those you guys know, swoop in, man. They know where they're going. They do. Oh. Is that your camera too, bro? Yeah, dude. You got two now? Yeah, yeah that'll be like, that's kind of Did like you even notice that? I didn't even notice that, that, that when I came in. Shit. That's yeah, that's all right. Yeah. I put it up when I'm driving, like, get some cool footage when I can. Oh, uh-huh, yeah. I need to stick it in my forehead when I go on mountain bike rides. Yeah, you get. you have something for your bike? Like, do you have a mount? No, well, I need to... You get a mount? Like, I need to pay bills before I buy more bells and whistles type thing. Dude, if you were, like, how like, what would you do with that? Like, would you put the videos on, uh, like, just your Instagram, throw them up? Yeah, I'll put them on Instagram, it's for fun, or send them to my parents. My parents like to see what I do with my son there, so whenever we go on a bike ride, that's pretty cool. To the so on YouTube, man. Sure, so like, yeah, I send them videos. Nice. And, like, you know, like last weekend or the weekend before, I was on a Kiwi Park with my kid, and uh, I didn't even see him. My son did. He's like, Dad, deer. And we, I hit the brakes and stopped, and there's a deer like four feet. You had a cute son on you. Yeah, like, I don't know if you guys saw that Instagram video. Yeah. We put our bikes yeah. down, and I'm like, like, you think I can pet it? And he's like, oh. You're petting a deer? That'd be so and cool. He gets all scared. I'm like, I'm going to do it. And I walk, uh, yeah. I got like 
probably like say the wall was the deer. Yeah. I was right, just, like, yeah, right here with my camera enough. before it ran away. Like I got about six feet away from it. How old is he? Okay, he's seven. He's gonna be right. eight uh, in August. Wait, wait. That's sweet. Yeah, do it. Like, uh, do you have a GoPro? No, I that's what I mean. I need the GoPro. Uh, and I need, GoPro and need the bracket for my mountain bike or for my helmet. The bracket would be pretty cool to get the yeah. tire stuff because like, it'd be similar to the videos you currently post of you biking. Well, I mean, similar like, to better I quality. I these too on Long Lake, like roof, roofing last weekend. Yeah. The GoPro would have been perfect for that. Cause, like, I was doing some pretty hairy shit, like off the yeah. ladder, trying to put some strapping in. Like, there are oh, some weird shit. Me. Don't post that shit, man. No, no, like I was tired off and everything. It right. was just like, I yeah. was shit in my pants, like nervous. I'm like, oh, like I'd love to put this on Instagram just to see yeah. everyone watch me cry. But I couldn't <laughs> hold a phone and hold my life and hold a hammer all at the same time. Yeah, right. And it was like blistering hot. Dead selfies. It was dead, dead selfies. <laughs> That's crazy. So it was like, man, I can get the mount and just let you use it. Cause I don't use it as often. Like I'd literally be like, "Yo, here, borrow it, take sweet photos, videos, put them no, on." I need my own there. I, I do a lot of pretty cool shit there through. It the does seasons. get broken. Wow, well, snowboarding too, right in the winter, kayaking, fucking mountain biking. I do. Yeah. Put it on while you roll and shit. I was gonna put. <laughs> that'd be crazy. <laughs> Just put it inside <laughs> your body. I've seen guys do that kickboxing. <laughs> yeah. Like with the head. Oh yeah. Gear. Oh yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah the head gear. <laughs> so put the put the ear gear on there. Yeah. You see Punch someone it. throw a hook, they miss, and then the camera goes. <laughs> yeah, you try to yeah. slip it. And, but yeah, I'm gonna use it today when we go cliff jumping for sure. Oh, I, yeah. I, I just hold it, and it's sweet. Like the, it's pretty sweet when it comes down. Max, stop gonna, cliff yeah. jump. Like she's gonna like record as like as because I like these transitions and stuff. Like we'll go off, and then I'm gonna cut it to like my shot. So then as soon as I'm out of frame in that one, come in yeah. frame in that. And then lay in the water because I'm up stuff. Pretty oh, sweet yeah. spot. So. Edit, uh, editing. Yeah, so I'll figure out, play around with that, and that'll be a be kind of what happens. Yeah, that's pretty sweet. Just trying to make dope shit like that. Make it happen. Make it happen. Put them up. That's stuff. sick. So, yeah. I was thinking about answering it before. Work I sucks. Yeah. But, yo, so how YouTube kind of works <laughs> is you need a minimum of a thousand subscribers to get the a ability to qualify to get, to get like, putting the ability to put ads on your videos, right? All right? And the more views you get, the more like money and ad revenue you generate, right? Because there's some that are pay per click too. Like if you just, like if you're watching one of the videos later and you click on the ad, I get money. All right. And that's how that works. All right. And that's kind of that whole system of how it all works, but you need right. a certain amount of subscribers first in start. order to qualify yeah. for it, right? right. Cool. It's like that you need 10,000 in order to be verified on Instagram, for example, right? It's like whatever that is might not be correct but that's kind of like how the idea like yeah you need yeah. qualify you need that and then that's how that kind of works so that's why it's like when you have a certain amount of subscribers and stuff i want to take this point where like i'd love to just sit and hang out with people and just fucking oh, learn yeah. from one yeah have to say and talk shit Joe Rogan, just Chat blow dudes yeah. and talk about life man. and he makes fuck, good money doing that because right? like hundreds of thousands in, like most Especially of them millions episode, and stuff. So like, this crazy. is sponsored by squarespace too. yeah and he's got a bunch of ads that pop up ads that play maybe not before but during and stuff yeah. and like his older episodes were like yeah, kind of like yeah they're pushing ads yeah, they pushing ads yeah and stuff. it was kind of different like, when it first started right yeah and i was like man it was schwack when it first started i don't know if you ever seen the first year they were like selling some sucked up shit man yeah dude. like fucking vibrators and shit yeah it was really <laughs> yeah <laughs> but then like slowly just build up yeah. and like not stop it so and that's the thing like i only got this one bigger than my last one was but quicker so we're not so. Recording kind of, oh yeah, yeah, yeah it's it's recording she's always recording, recording man look at yeah. the voices being recorded yeah so could. Oh, so, I thought we were just discussing. Yeah. It's the whole point of it. Yeah. yeah. We'll just discuss shit. Just chill. Yeah, I'm just chilling. Yeah. Yeah. Wanting out all oh, work. Stressing right? me out. Good. good. Figuring it out. Good. Yeah, good. 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 So subscribe to this. <laughs> to Glenn. It'll be right. Glenn show like, right where he is. Life after high school. Yeah, dude. That's, That's what he's thinking. He's thinking of a new title for his new podcast. Now call it My Fucked Up Friends. No, that's too. <laughs> so <laughs> what's <in> the camera? <laughs> we were once uh, a couple weeks ago for Miguel's like going away uh, event. We, oh yeah, you yeah. mentioned something about getting hit in the head with a hammer once. What? And I want to hear that. Just story. once. Just. I want to hear this story. It's gonna be its own thing. I just want. I want to hear this. Really? Whole thing. Yeah. 
Yeah. This is what I mean earlier when I was like, yo, if there's nothing you want me to do. Yeah, no, I can tell you, it's just fucked up, man. Yeah. Oh, for it's a not serious really, hammer? Not really like fucking a serious uh, ordeal? Or just playing around. Radio shit. Oh, perfect. Yeah, yeah, no, uh, before legalization and everything, um, my friends used to sell a lot of weed. Mm. And uh, there's never really any animosity in that industry before all the opioids became a problem. Okay. <laughs> like once Oxycontin came out, people started doing really crazy shit just to steal a bag of weed. And it wasn't because they wanted the weed, it's because they wanted the money for the weed to buy more opiates and Oxycontin. That being said, um, one, 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 of my, <laughs> one of my good friends moved a lot of cannabis. And uh, we were sitting there, I was at his place on a Sunday, like he's one of my closest friends since high school, or even elementary school. So we were sitting there and uh, I think we were watching You Gotta Eat here. Nice. On like yeah. Food Network. Yeah. So like, I think they were going through like burger trucks or food trucks or some shit. I think it was burgers or tacos, whatever. I think it was burgers. <laughs> but anyway, like fuck man. We are just sitting there Sunday, smoking weed, watching a food show. And uh, yeah, his, he was in the basement apartment of a little house in the dungeon in there. And, uh, yeah, in the middle of watching the episode, his kitchen door got kicked open, which was kind of like four or five steps up from the kitchen. He had this, like, as soon as you came in the door, there was a landing, and you walked down into the apartment. That's fucked up. But, uh, yeah, we're sitting there smoking weed, chilling out, watching you got to eat here, and the door got kicked open. Three got, three big guys came in all wearing black ski masks. They all fall masks. because there's a drop at the door. <laughs> all wearing no, what? The, uh, they had to wear a ski mask? I you got a ski mask on? Yeah, you got a roll up? You gonna let me finish? Damn, sorry, like, yeah, keep going. going. All right, <clears throat> there's a ski mask. They all had three, all three of them, probably all above 200 pounds, between like 5'10 and 6'2". Three of them, black ski mask, black clothes, whatever you say. The first guy had a yellow fucking uh, fiberglass hammer, like, you know, those shitty yellow hammers you get from Dollarama. Yeah. The second guy had a can of bear mace, and the third guy had a big fucking nine-inch knife. Oh, shit. Uh, the first guy came up. I went square up with him, he hit me in the head, or he went to hit me in the head, I, I backed up, and then the second guy behind him sprayed me with a bear mace, and the first guy hit me, swung at me again, he just clipped my nose with the claw of the hammer, and pretty mm. much ripped my nose open. Dang. But then uh, the guy with the bear mace, I tried to swing at, I think we connected with each other, and then I, I fell to the ground, and when I looked up, I thought the guy was going to hit me with the hammer again. Right. I think he got in the cross of the bear maze because mm -hmm. he just ran out of the building. He disappeared. Oh, I think he was like, probably fucking it. Yeah, and when I looked up, the guy with the bear maze just stood above me and he emptied the whole can on my oh, face. Oh, shit. What happened with the third guy with the knife was uh, my buddy who was in the living room. He grabbed the guy with the knife like that and like had brought it him, but the guy pushed him and he fell back and he had one of those glass coffee tables. My buddy went through the fucking glass coffee table, totally tore his back to shit. Battery? But, uh, might be. Yeah, basically the idiot yeah, sprayed so much bear mace into a one bedroom apartment that everyone had everyone to run out. Fucked. Mm -hmm. So like once a, I like once the can I heard the can <laughs> stop spraying, I looked up and the guy mm -hmm. ran away and then I I got up, I ran out of the bedroom that I was in to back to the living room because yeah. we had kind of far away into the bedroom. Right. My buddy was getting out of the glass table as the other guy with the knife was running out. So it was just like, yeah, they fucked themselves, like spraying all the bear mace. But at the end of it, yeah, my nose was broken. I had like a, the claw of the hand went right through my fucking head and I was soaked head to toe with a full can of bear mace. My buddy had like a ton of fucking wounds on his back from the glass coffee table. Ugh. The crazy thing was we went like, the fucking, uh, <clears throat> We got ambulance to the hospital, and then like that day, and the, they wouldn't let us in the emerge. They put us in an incubation chamber with two cold showers, and they made right. us stay there for about an hour and a half, almost two hours, just standing there, like, because there's so much cayenne pepper and bear mace, yeah, and that, it's that, in the yeah. Yeah. Fucking yeah, sucked. Yeah, and then uh, they brought us in finally in, like, robes and stuff, and we're like, the, the doctor himself said, like, you guys are like the boondock saints because we were walking around all fucked up, like, cracking jokes. He's like, how's your nose feel? I'm like, fuck. You wouldn't believe what Bay Rice does to your sinuses, doc. Listen. <laughs> <laughs> so he's like, you guys are fucking nuts. 
But, uh, yeah, it was a crazy night. Man. That's when I got hit the head with a hammer. Jesus. They basically asked us for statements on what happened, and then uh, they let us go, and then I got arrested the next day for trafficking just because of the weed they found and everything. And then I went to court, though, and they said, no, he was, he was just uh, guilty by association. He was in the wrong place at the wrong time. They let me go. Nice. Easy. Yeah. But yeah, lots of bear race and the hammer, like, I can't remember which side it is. Tell me which side it is. It's a little like your right side, man. Yeah, that's that yeah. Sure. yeah. Nose looks yeah. fucked right up. Yeah, just like, Your left side. He, he sprayed me, side. so like when I was coming, it went like, and just caught me. But if I hadn't have got bear mace first, it would have went, the hook of the hammer would have went oh, my eye. Man. So I'm kind of glad, yeah, I got bear mace first, because it would have taken my fucking eye. Bit of eye pirate eye. fuck. Exactly. Yeah. All right. <laughs> Yeah. So there you go. There's, there's well, the patch would probably right. suit you, bro. You probably run the patch. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. You run the patch, no problem. I don't even know what that is. So which side is it? I was forget. That it's, side, bro. Yeah. Right there? yeah, it's all dented in. You can see. No, there's the scars little... there, though. Right scars right here? Is, yeah. You okay, yeah. So he hit me this probably side. Yeah. 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 That's just, why Yeah, he just hit me. Like I said, if you didn't spray me, it would have It would have hit me really hard. But he sprayed me and I fell back and it just like slid off. Just like the hook of the hammer. Back when the weed was legal, man. That's now you don't have to deal with this what? shit. Now the shit is like being through the the, the Used trade to be like the whole wild time. West like, out here. I'd never <laughs> seen it like that. Like for ten years, I'd never seen anyone be wild oh, yeah, like that over a couple yeah. pounds of weed. Junk, weed. He's but once the the, the opiate anything, shit man. started, it was fucking insane, man. Like it got so yes. violent, it was ridiculous. Yeah. We had we had this yeah. fucking crackhead let us shoot him with a twenty two. He had a, <laughs> for some what? crack, bro. For some crack. Yeah, he had a vest on. Right? <laughs> Alright, my buddy uh, uh, same buddy. Same buddy uh, with the bird, right? His dad had the bird, same buddy. Got <laughs> with the bird. Alright. His dad was a crack dealer, right? On the reserve. So when you're a crack dealer, you get a lot of shit offered to you, you know. So he got he got his hands on a bulletproof vest. Right? So he gives it to his son for whatever reason, I don't care. But anyways, we're bored one day, smoking some weed. And there's this, like, there's always crackheads around there trying to do odd jobs for his dad and shit, you know, and get some rock. So we're just like, yo, you think this thing works? And he's like, well, it's legit. You know, it had, like, tag and look legit. So like, all the calibers of guns that could withstand all that, right? And there's some heavy calibers on there. So we're like, well, you got 22. It's 22 let's fucking, there. Let's fucking shoot this thing. <laughs> no. And he's like, he's like. All right, so we're gonna go shoot this thing, and all of a sudden, Buddy's there, fucking doing like some bricklaying on their garage or whatever for his dad, and he's like, he's like, yo, I forget his name, but he's like, yo, come here. He's like, yo, you want whatever amount of crack? He's like, for what? He's like, just let us shoot you with his vest on, point two. He's like, all right. He's like, great way without a flinch, you know what I mean? He's like, he's like all right. Oh, man. Just, so we put like a little red thing on there, a little target, you know. He's over there practicing, you know, practicing his shot. He's like hitting close to bullseyes every time. And funny, so it's not close, but far enough so it won't go through, you know. So we good range. We don't know what the fuck we're doing, you know. We're just like, we're just going to shoot this crackhead <laughs> with the best. That's why, too. I'm not shooting it. My buddy yeah. shoots him. But anyways. Lines it up, bang, crackhead drops. He's like, <laughs> like, it doesn't go through, but we're like, oh shit. And <laughs> he gets, he's, he's kind of hurting for a bit. Oh, he gets back up, big well, bro, underneath. Like, it stopped the bullet. The bullet was like mushed straight in, like, like it stopped it, right? It was legit. But like, he was, this crackhead was hurting for that, bro. <laughs> so, but yeah, he gave him the gave shit. shit. Yeah, he gave him shit. He was happy. We were like, yo, best works is fucking awesome. We're like, yeah, this fucking stuff. Twenty two. He's like, well, now I know it works. But yeah, the thing was like <laughs> smushed in and broken. It worked. It was, it was pretty cool, man. We did a lot of crazy it. shit. Yeah. Man, with that, that guy. What's his name? Craig, I think. Can I yeah, Craig. get him on? Get him. Wow, you live in London, man. I don't know. I don't even know, man. I'll fly out. I don't even know. I'll fly, I'll out. fly out. Yeah. Talk oh, that guy probably out. got some stories, man, for sure. Jeez. Man. Wow. Like, I left the res and they all stayed there, right? So they got a little way more stories than me. <laughs> this is some crazy shit. Even Corey, you know Corey, right? Yep. When he first came and worked down there, I was 19, like just out of high school. I think he was a little bit older, mm -hmm. but he just came down and worked there. First day I met him, he's like, yo, you smoke? I'm like, smoke what? <laughs> he's like, you know, he's like, you know, weed. I'm like, 
dude. I was like, you're on the yeah, res, man. Yeah, man. It's like, I'm high as fuck right now. Like, let's go. It's like, what do you want? What do you need? Let's go get it. So we go, I, I just met this guy too, like worked with him one day. So we're driving. I got, I got like this Monte Carlo. Legal, like illegal as fuck. I don't even have a license at this point. I don't think right. it was suspended or something, but I'm driving around the res. And so we go get some weed. I go to my buddy's house. I leave him in the car. Cause it's a white guy, right? I'm not gonna go right. Really. So, so I just go in the back, and like I guess it was just good timing, cause like once I turn the corner in the back, all of a sudden two shotgun bullets go like, you know, go off. I think nothing of it, right? Cause like this shit happens all the time. We're like, what the? Is this buddy's sister was shooting the shotgun for the first time or whatever? And we're like, oh yeah, right on, blah blah blah. We need some weed. We're just shooting the shit. And just, I'm thinking like nothing of it, and I'm like. Smoking a little bit of weed, and we're just talking, gabbing. Mm-hmm. And fucking, I go back and I get there, and Corey's like, just like, just strong right. I was like, what happened, man? What the fuck was that? I was like, he's like, are you all right? He's like, what the fuck, yeah. man? And I'm like, what you, what's wrong with you, man? He's like, yo, the gunshots, man. I was like, did someone shoot at us? Like, he's like, I thought you were dead. <laughs> he's like, I thought you were dead. I was like, I hear pictures. Yeah, he was yeah. like, I thought you were dead, man. I was like, you go around the corner, I hear two shots, and you're gone. Like and then you never came back. It's been like 15 minutes. I'm like, holy shit, man! I was like, you waiting here 15 minutes, bro? I was like, you're solid as fuck, bro. You, I was like, if that was me, I would have gotten that car and fucked right off. <laughs> <laughs> like I would not stick around for 15 minutes for someone to come around with a gun and shoot my ass. <laughs> I was like, what are you doing? <laughs> like, yeah, of course, it's legit. Yeah, yeah, of course, it's legit though. But that was good shit, is. man. And like, yeah, when he went down there, man, he was like. One of the three guys who stayed on the reserve while they worked. Everyone else right. would go to London, yeah. which was like 20 minutes away, just stay in a hotel. And, but, but yeah, he was a gym. Nice. Him and Nikki. I don't know if you met Nikki. I don't know Nikki He's pretty cool, too. Oh. Oh, Cat's cool. Cat? Yeah, Cat Man's cool. Cat's cool. Yeah, for sure. Nice. You met Cat, eh? Oh, yeah, he went to Charles. Or to something with him. Oh, UFC? Andre, yeah, Andre. I did. Andre. Yes. Yeah, the UFC. They right? call him Cat. Yeah. yeah. Took, me chill. took me a while to figure that out. Man, I'm so bummed that I didn't go to that. I should have went. Yeah, it's that like UFC it's trip it's with it's Mitch. Should have went. My buddy. I should have went too. Yeah. I cut like thirty pounds and tried to compete in the tournament. And fucking died. Oh yeah, it was yeah. the same week as that, eh? Andre, yeah. Yeah. Stupid. Ugh. But no excuses, Budo man. Budo? Yeah, I should do the Budo. Dude, you said yeah. it. You posted about it. You got to do Uh-oh. it now. Yeah. You got it. Yeah, yeah, you're yeah. Sure, man. You're like right after, you're like, I lost no I wanted, excuses. See you soon, Budo or something. Oh, I'll do the Budo, but I wanted to do the Nogi one too. And then just Isn't that next week though? L- yeah, life bullshit. Aren't you doing that? Yep. Nice. Yeah. No, no, Where is that? Brampton? Yep. Yep. I was thinking of going with Cord. Just go chill out. If I can make it down just to support, I will. Yeah, I just had too much life bullshit get, but I couldn't train at all, man. Yeah. That's get back with my kid there. Professor's going, going too. Yeah. Is he competing? Well, he's competing. He's yeah, competing. competing apparently, yeah. Nice. Yeah, so I'd be good. You got me, Brady, and Corey competing. For white belts and that. Brady. 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 Psycho ass little blonde kid there. Oh, the fast dude? The fat. They're all fucking fast. No, this guy, when, kids, when we do man. the sprints. We do the yeah, sprints, this yeah, guy's yeah. always first. Yeah, bro. just trip. Yeah. yeah. Just trip. That's what I'll say. I'm gonna He's watching right now. Coming for you, buddy. Fuck him, just trip that kid. Coming for you. <laughs> I'm just trying <laughs> next time. No, we get good rounds in him and I Oh, yeah. Yeah. oh, oh yeah, yeah, I love rolling yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah, we get good rounds. If I'm having an off day. I get a little lazy there sometimes and I hear guys like you and I you remind me like you can't be fucking lazy when these young kids are learning this fast, right? Right. It reminds me like oh you're, you're, I'm, I'm, I'm not that much better. I'm just this much better. You're always a couple steps I ahead. Be, it I feels like you. you yeah, are. I can't. Feels be, like you're, I can't be lazy with you guys because you mm-hmm. learn very quickly, and I'm still learning too, right? So right. Can't be fucking arrogant like that. Yeah. Play that shit, or I'll end up getting my ass kicked by That's you in fair. a couple months. Right. I'm kick your ass right now. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> Start, man. Make me end this right here live. We'll cut next clip of uh, them rolling. I mean, get choked out. <laughs> 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 it's just out. Of right. it. <clears throat> no, he's dope. Like, let's roll with everyone, man. Let's go. Everybody. Yeah, it's fun. Hell yeah. I like rolling with Alex a lot now that I understand how to defend arm bars. 
What, uh, Rodriguez? Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, he's fucked for a kid. His uh, size and weight, he's pretty lethal. Though. Yeah, he's, he's spider monkey your back, and I'm like, get that fuck off my back, man. Just fucking drop back on his Do, and it does nothing. Squish him. Does oh, nothing. He's more he sees it coming, turns, and then takes my arm for a walk. It's fast. Yeah, man, it. it's when, if he's done it to you 27, 28 times, then you're going to know. Like, yeah, like I know I was setting it, it up. Like he kind of sets it up in the gi with like a cross collar, and if I defend that, he takes the arm. Fuck, like so. I saw him win like a whole tournament with that once. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Just like, Brandon, arm, 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 yeah. guard, boom, yeah. boom, Just attack boom, the right boom, knee. Boom. Just attack the right knee. It works, <laughs> man. What? Yeah. He's great, man. He's good. Mm-hmm. He's good. Yeah. You know who else has done really good for the seasons around this podcast and people are going to watch it? Fucking uh, Phil. Phil, yeah, uh, Phil's Ty, so Ty for sure, Lee. man. Yeah, yeah. Those guys joined and uh, yeah. kind of. They're always I, I there, know, man. I, know Ty, I guess Tyler had there. a bit of a uh, wrestling experience from high school or something. That makes a lot of sense. Phil, yeah. Phil had some previous jiu-jitsu experience from Ottawa, I think. Not much. Yeah. But like those he guys, was, fucking haul ass, months. man. And I, I have a lot of respect. Phil's for mad time is like they, it's always there. They are, they're fucking good. I remember. Yeah. I remember a couple of days he wasn't there. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> <laughs> you keep track on your fucking Excel chart. <laughs> no, I just man, like mm-hmm. for guys that kind of come in after the fact, or like not down talking about anything, but like after the fact a little overweight and everything and just fuck man they fight just as hard if not harder than every single person and there they've been more to prove them and they really no, no i think they just i think they just want to impress themselves just want to get better at That's the art That's That's good fuck, at I, I love it man they, they do yeah. great they only compete with one improve. person yeah Especially Phil competitively and Tyler too. Like, yeah, Phil's competing. I think game. they both competed. Yeah, now. they both did. They they yeah, both the medaled now. Yeah, nice. and to see guys come in like that, fucking right, man. Yeah, it's, it's nice. It's good. It's what you want to see. Heavy. Like if I sleep on both of them, there. Oh, like, they make, they make Tyler today, then I was, fuck, I was all over his back today. He was yanking my leg down, threw me back on the mat. I tried to triangle. He fucking threw my leg over, yeah, past yeah. my guard. I had to re-guard. There's like, no gear. Yeah. yeah, and by the end of it, fucking uh, Brandon and Shane were sitting there like, fuck, that was a really nice round to watch, man. You guys yeah. are doing good there. And like, this guy was doing it like almost seven years. He started like a year ago. Right. So fuck. These yeah. guys are learning really, really, really fast. And it's mm-hmm. awesome. It's, it's good because it pushes you guys to get to get better to like yeah. not slack and stuff. exactly you get to a point where you think you're good and yeah. then you see someone younger learning that quickly and you're like no i'm not good i'm just better but i have to keep learning yeah. like, otherwise he's gonna kick my ass just like this yeah. guy i don't know why the fuck we decided to teach him jujitsu just wait, wait, till, yeah. Yeah. wait till i start getting good though bro yeah. oh well, you're already learning just right? yeah. Yeah. you start you starting to pass guard the dominance over. there yeah. Like, oh, yeah. Fuck, yeah not just like the Grab the legs, pass the side control, and hold. It's getting. Uh, it's human chest. Yeah, it's sweet. Yeah. Do you're what? Well, you're four straight three. blue? Three? Two, one. Three. I think it's three. Mm-hmm. Yeah, when is the next grading? You know? Sure. Like, um, damn, bro. No rush. Was it like once every five no years? No rush. You said you started nine years ago? Fuck, bro. Seven. Go on, like, seven. Bro. It was like he's into seven. I don't fucking choose that, man. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, I don't care. Okay. It's all. It's not up to us. I don't. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm just gonna I'd, show up. I, I just feel like I might lose a stripe on the next one. <laughs> <laughs> That's the only thing. I'm like, as long as I don't lose, I'm like, oh, no, I don't know who the fuck like show up. I, I had John. It's an extra day on the mat. John Cole says that all the time at the tournaments. Like, still a blue belt, dude. I don't. I don't control it. I don't. Yeah. It's not up to me. And you're not like you're probably not in a rush, right? I don't give a shit. Yeah, like I don't care at all. I'm not like that competitive with jiu jitsu. Right. Like I, 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 I like what Tom DeBlas said. Like, um, competition is a sacrifice for your love of jiu jitsu. So like every once in a while I do compete because I want I, I know how good I am at troop, but I want to go down to Toronto and I want to see how good I am in Ontario. Right? Oh, yeah. That's my theory. Mm-hmm. 
But like, I, I don't know. Fuck, I had a lot going on in my life, so it's hard to like focus Find the competitively time. Yeah. on jiu-jitsu. Yeah, man. But I can always train. I can always, can always train. train. I can yeah. always learn. You can always make it a couple I can, times. Yeah, a week. I can always show up. Hell yeah. Like fuck, man. Like the competitive side. Like I used to put a lot of pressure on myself to do it, and then like other aspects of my life would drain me out. It kind of ruins it too. Yeah, so yeah, then man. you get mad at you. You don't like having fun no more when you're rolling and shit. So it's all about like our art of balance in life, right? Right. But at the end of the day, like I don't promote myself. That's not my call. So. Yeah, I mean, you know, the song with Corey, I'm like, man, I'm not in a rush. Like, why? If I'm gonna be doing like it's not, oh, I'm doing this so I can just get my blue belt. It's yeah, like, that's silly. No, you want the black belt. Dude, the day you get, I want. I just want to keep learning. And if the day you get your blue belt, though, you'll go home and you'll sit there on the couch and be like, like, well, well, I'm still not a fucking ninja. Like, yeah, nothing like, changed. I right? don't feel much the different. Same guy. It's still the same. Man, I'm gonna wear that bitch around town. Be like, fucking go to Walmart and with my blue belt on, get yeah. milk and shit. Just yeah, man. <laughs> no man, it's a it's, yeah. a it's a long journey. Like, well, yeah, you, sure. you get you get uh, eager, I guess, for like the next step, like the next sign of uh, yeah, you know, acknowledgement. I, I just want to be in that lineup for when sense someone else gets promoted. You know, you get right. to do your thing. You'll get to the blue belt, and you just, you're still going into the same tricks every day. You're still learning, right. and then you all of a sudden you're gonna want the purple belt. Yeah. So just enjoy the ride. Enjoy Purple's the ride. not my color, though. Shut up. Alright, guys. Thanks for doing this. Let's go jump off the cliff. Yeah. Let's go jump off the cliff.